morning. It is 6.15 a.m. Sean and I are, oh, what? We are about to get on the Skylink. That one's not ours, this one's ours. And we are headed to Mexico this morning. So we try to get on the first flight of the day so we can spend as much time on the beach as possible. We're cutting it very, very close though. So, yeah, are you excited to go to Mexico? Yeah. Sean and I have our personal items with us. We're taking Spirit and so they nickel and dime me for everything, right? But it was the cheapest flight of the day and at the time that we wanted, so it's fine. We packed all of our stuff in one extra large suitcase thinking, oh, it'll be like maybe 50 pounds. And uh, it was 65, so Spirit charged us $125 for a bag that's like 15 pounds over, which is insane. So I told Sean, I'm like, we may as well go and get another suitcase, possibly while we're in Mexico, or just pay for another checked bag that's like significantly cheaper than paying the overweight fee. But it's so expensive. What did you say? Your stuff out. <laughs> not a chance. I literally thought I packed the bare minimum. So, guess not. Maybe it's your stuff. Maybe it's the smallest. It's the circle here. <laughs> this is my little Cancun flowy airport fit. I saw this TikTok the other day and it was saying how people show up to the airport and they walk to their gate and they want to make sure that their gate exists like before they go get food or go to the bathroom or whatever and that's so Sean and I like we will go out of our way to make sure that our gate is there and like nothing makes us miss our flight. My golden retriever husband takes the middle seat basically every single flight, whether it's a long haul flight or a short one, because I get super motion sick. And I was just telling him that I forgot to take my Dramamine, so I need to take that right as we get to our seat. But how sweet is that? Middle seat man for his wife. whenever you land in Cancun and you've got 85 people asking you if they can taxi you to wherever you're going and I hired a private taxi that's what I always do whenever we fly in here it's just easier we get our own transportation settled prior to our trip but now we have to find it we found our guy and now we're off we're gonna go get in our taxi they were out of sedans so we got a limo <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is hilarious. This is so funny. We are riding in style. Yeah. <laughs> We haven't told y'all, but this is our anniversary trip. We've been married for five years now. <laughs> Would you like a cocktail? <laughs> Happy anniversary to us. Our driver said there's been a lot of sugar daddies back here. Sorry, Marco. We'll be right back. We'll be right back. Just lifted up. Oh, oh, it's a TV. Oh my God. I cannot get enough of this car. This is too funny, is Marco. Thank you so much. Thank you. Did you get your phone while the bus with you? Yes. This is what we were picked up in. That is hilarious. It looks the exact same that it did a few years ago when we were here. It's so nice to be back. I love him. Sean 
Sean and I are waiting for our room to be ready. We got here about an hour ago. We had lunch. There's a foam party going on. We are so jealous that we are not in the foam party right now, but we can't even get to our suitcases right now. So we are just watching the ocean, the foam flying up and everything from afar. Sean and I were here at the exact same resort in 2021 and they were doing COVID testing here to get back to the States. And I filmed our entire experience here. I filmed my COVID test, that was traumatic. But anyways, we don't have to do that this go around. So we are just so happy to be back. The food is the same, The I mean, down to the chairs, the chairs are the same. We are breaking a sweat, waiting for our room to be ready, but we're so excited to show you guys around this beautiful resort. It's lively, there's tons of weddings this weekend. There's a bunch of stuff going on, so I think we're gonna have a blast here. So because we are Diamond members, they gave us this thank you for your loyalty sash on our door. You've got your magic door right here. So whenever you order room service, once it comes up, they'll just open up the door, they'll put your food here, and then they turn on this light to tell you that your food is here. And then you just open, open. You just open it on. <laughs> In fact, I just ordered some room service. So let's see if it's here. Hello. <laughs> it's so lame. To the left, we've got a little place to put your luggage, drawers, you've got your mini bar. And if I can open it, you've got water and some sodas and beer. Over here, you've got a really beautiful and clean, simple bathroom. It's actually really, Sean said grand. And it is very grand, it's very beautiful. I love the arch. Two sinks, good lighting, big closet. They didn't just give us this set of robes. They also gave us robes on the back, so I'm excited. You've got your toilet, you've got a nice standing shower with a little seat option over there. And then you'll walk through this arch. And we've got, is this as big as our, is this a California cake? There's a hair on it. Starting to bubble up in my throat a little bit, but it's okay. We're gonna move on. Move on. Um, robes. Super excited for these. These seem honestly. We probably won't put these on because they look a little worn. <laughs> but anyways. And then you've got your little couch set up over here. Your jacuzzi over here. Bringing it back to the '70s when you had jacuzzis next to the bed. Seating area and. This hotel is the only hotel that Sean and I have not had at least a partial ocean view. Um, but that's okay, because it's still gonna be a good time. And this is our view. We're staring at another hotel and guests coming in and out. But there's palm trees, blue skies. We really can't complain. Okay, time to Sunscreen. Bikini. Sunscreen and bikini. All right, we'll see you in five, four, three, two, one. Another diamond member perk here, which actually wasn't here last time, but is here a few years later, is that they give diamond members a section of the beach to be able to have like cabanas or lawn chairs with umbrellas and Normally, if you have a cabana at the pool or a cabana on the beach, you have to pay extra, but very blessed to be here. Sean got an Irish cream coffee and I'm getting a chai. 
Catalina, who is one of the front desk receptionists, she is amazing. And for our anniversary, she upgraded Sean and I to a better balcony view. So the room is the exact same. I'm not gonna give you another room tour, but our view, if I can open this door, is now overlooking the garden. And that is where the lobby is and all the chairs and the main bar. And then you pan over here, there's the pool, and then the ocean is all the way back there. You see a little bit of a ferry. So this is awesome. We are super, super, super grateful for you, Catalina. You killed it. Here's the banana loaf. Mmm. oh my gosh. It has peanut butter, chocolate chips, crunchy little sugary bits on top. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. This is the fit for tonight. I went with a low back dress and some strappy heels. I'm absolutely in love with them. And tell them about your quintessential outfit. <laughs> I'm a sailor's dream. <laughs> breakfast tea because coffee upsets my stomach but I need a big caffeine boost today it is eight o'clock I wanted to get up around seven but both of our alarms went off and we were just snoozing 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 away welcome to our first full day in Playa del Carmen I am already sweating. <laughs> it's only 10 o'clock. It's hot, hot, hot here. We are in our swimsuits. We are done with the gym, done with breakfast. We are now going to lounge around and just rot in the pool and in our beach chairs all day long. Sean and I come to Mexico at least once a year, sometimes twice a year since we first started dating eight years ago. We're super blessed to have the opportunity to be here often and I don't know, I just, I'm like in this beautiful little nook of the hotel and I just feel super grateful. And this is just so beautiful, like this mural so beautiful, everything's so beautiful. So I'm just going to soak in the day. <laughs> Good deed of the day. And I don't care what any of y'all have to say. Oh, mama. Ooh, excellent. 
terrible I haven't talked to you since early this morning but we have spent all day at the pool it's exactly what we needed to just like soak up the sun restore our souls and just rejuvenate we actually met three awesome couples so we've just been chatting with them for the last several hours we've met some really awesome people here and it's just, it's been amazing. But we walked to our door because we're about to shower and change for dinner. And we walked to our door and they have happy anniversary. What are you doing? Can I take a picture of Oh, sorry. That was so sweet. And then we walked in and they had champagne waiting for us and a few little desserts. Did you have a good day today? Yeah, I had a nice. How did you like just like sitting in our chairs and sitting at the pool and just chilling and not doing anything? It was a beautiful day, so it was super nice. Because normally we would go, like we would be active, so we would maybe chill for like half of the day and then we'd go like scuba diving or snorkeling or whatever, but I think this trip, y'all, I think we may just And we met some really nice people, though. You know, it was nice to chat with them. Yeah, that's what I said too. All right, time to get ready for dinner. I honestly, I can't tell you any of their names. Recorded. No, I, was, me. I, was, I was telling you, I can't remember. Any no, of the me names. either. Now we have to come up with like. Yeah, let me see your driver's license. <laughs> let, me see your driver's license. <laughs> let us know when you forget somebody's name How and you've you been forget? talking to them for hours. And honestly, I don't even think we forgot. I think none of us have even introduced ourselves. We, we know just our all came names. together. Yeah, we know <laughs> our stripper names. Yeah. Yeah, your stripper name supposedly is like your first pet that you ever had and then the first street that you ever lived on. So we went around and told each other our stripper name. The one guy was like 5th, 52nd Street. <laughs> County Road. There's a stretching class going on behind me and I thought it was at 9.30, but it was at nine. So I'm sad I missed it. And the, all the workout classes seem to be full here. I mean, it's a really busy weekend for this hotel, but I only got to do water aerobics so far. Ugh. A storm is a brewing. somebody's wedding day today. They're gonna get married at the gazebo. That is so cute. Sean and I just got ready. We are going to take photos on the beach and around the hotel with a professional photographer. So I'm really excited about that. And this is the fit that we're going with. We've got some cute little strappy shoes and I'm just obsessed with this dress. I've only got to wear it one other time. So I'm glad I get to get some pictures in it. Sean looks handsome as always. Our room looks over the wedding reception that's going on. So I'm hoping that we get to see the bride and groom at some point, whether it's in our hotel room on our balcony or downstairs. We are gonna go, I'm not gonna brush out my curls until we get down there because it's so humid. My curls do not stand a chance and I don't want just a rat's nest on my head. But yeah, what do you think? Day. 
today. It is the end of the day. Sean and I are going to sit on our balcony and we're gonna people watch and just enjoy the sounds of the pool and the ocean and all of that. But I did wanna show you, we got our pictures today. We only opted for five, I think, but I'm really glad that we did it. Like we didn't want prom like super posed photos. And I think the photographer had something else in mind, but we were able to at least get a few really memorable snapshots. So the first one is me on the beach and I was just frolicking around, to be honest with you. I was like, here, I'm just gonna spin, I'm just gonna twirl, like you just like point and shoot and I'm sure we'll get a good one. And then he did have Sean pose and this is one of my favorite pictures now of Sean. He looks so handsome. Oh, I'm gonna frame that one. Okay, I love this one. I'm so glad that we have this one. Look how sweet. So that is going to be one that I post for sure tomorrow for our anniversary um, on social media. But I, I am in love with this photo. And then this one was really, really cute and fun and just, I don't know. It does seem posed, right? But I still think it's really beautiful. And then this one was not posed. This is just me, again, frolicking around on the beach. So I think the five that we got were great. Around 10 a.m. this morning, the entertainment team came up to everyone around the pool and asked if people wanted to join the arts and crafts activity that they had for the day. And so I made my own little keychain and it's so cute. It is beadwork, so this took me so long to do. It's very tedious and I'll probably never do beadwork again. I'm just not cut out for it, but maybe I'll bring this home. One of my family members will want it. And then we'll see you tomorrow for our fifth year wedding anniversary.